As governments around the world have taken steps to slow the spread of COVID-19, typical efforts to stop dengue fever have gotten lost in the shuffle. Dengue fever, a debilitating disease transmitted by mosquitoes, has seen exploding numbers in some areas recently, including Southeast Asia and South America. First-time victims report flu-like symptoms, and sometimes there are no symptoms at all. The second time, it can be a different story, excruciating headaches, joint pain, and even death. Money that would usually be used to fight dengue by destroying mosquito breeding sites and large-scale disinfection has been redirected in some places to fighting the coronavirus. Some experts are concerned that the overlapping outbreaks could overwhelm already strained healthcare systems. Malaysia, Thailand, and the Philippines have been particularly hard hit, and in South America, Brazil counted over a million dengue cases with almost 400 deaths this year. As for Paraguay, over 200,000 cases. Singapore said last week it'll likely beat its annual record of 22,000 dengue cases. A five-fold increase in mosquito larvae was recorded during the two-month coronavirus lockdown. For Newsy, I'm Gage Jackson.